Today I'm gonna to be trying to dive bomb on the harp. Uh, I don't think this has been done before, but there's probably a good reason for that. A few months ago, I made a video on the Bigsby pedal and I got an overwhelming amount of comments from people telling me to try the Digitech Whammy, which I have here, thanks to the support and the generosity from my viewers during one of my live streams. I picked this up in mint condition. <laughs> Brand new, in the box. She has the box. Pretty good. I'm excited. So I was playing through this thing, looking at all the different modes, and I came across a mode called Dive Bomb. <laughs> and I was like, what's, what's a dive bomb? Can I do that on harp? So I reached out to my good friend and guitar expert, Scott Poley, to help us understand what a dive bomb is. Hey Emily, Scott here. So you wanna know what a dive bomb is? Really simple, all you need is a guitar with a tremolo arm or whammy bar. You don't need a Floyd Rose, although it will make your guitar play a bit more in tune. And all you do to dive bomb is you grab hold of the whammy bar, the tremolo arm, and push down. That's a harmonic. Or you can do runs with it. So that's it. Love your videos. Catch you later. That's pretty easy and straightforward, right? It's pretty good. That's awesome. <laughs> I was looking into dive bombs a little deeper too, and I've heard some that are like squealy, like squealing ones, you know? Um, so I reached out to Stephen Bradley to ask him what is that? Because uh, I want to try it. <laughs> I want to do that on harp. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm Stephen Bradley. I'm going to give you a quick little tutorial on how to do those pinch harmonic, squealy, screaming dive bombs. You're going to need a humbucker, preferably, and you're going to need a tremolo. You're going to need to create an artificial harmonic with your pick. You're going to use the flesh of your thumb and the pick and strike the string at the same time, creating something like this. you're gonna want to depress the whammy bar with a bit of style like this. And bend it either down or up. Or this. Yeah. And you're gonna wanna do the face, of course. Since we can't do a pinch harmonic on harp, we're just gonna do a regular harmonic. So I'm gonna cut the string in half using the side of my palm and I'm gonna pluck the string with my thumb for the left hand. And then for the right hand, I'm gonna cut the string in half with the side of my pointer finger and pluck with the thumb. So we'll see if that works. So I'm using distortion with this. I'm gonna be running it through the Empress Heavy and I'll be using my bass compressor before it goes into the whammy. Should I just go for it? Yeah. <laughs> I just, I like, my foot doesn't move as fast as like the whammy bar does on a guitar. Hold on, I gotta like. Is that it? Get in there. You get, I mean, it, you know. Okay, so look, look, you're gonna go big and then little, 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 really consistent. Okay. okay? I know, my foot doesn't yeah, go that fast. I know, right. but you gotta try it. You gotta get your whole foot on it. You wanna take your boot off? All right. All right. So look, 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 look. You go, bing, wee, 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 wee. Stay like up there without your, without your heel going. I gotta like, I gotta like bend down. Huh? I gotta like flex, buddy. Let me try it with my foot while you play, okay? Hold on. You got the Puma socks from Costco? I got the Puma socks from Costco. You wanna go barefoot? No, no. Okay, okay ready? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's tough. You're gonna to want to do the face, of course. It's like that song. You know what I mean? You know what song I'm talking about? The. <laughs> I have no idea what song you're talking about. The song that goes. What do you think about dive bombs? It sounds like a baby screaming or something. Like. <laughs> like what? Do... <laughs> you're trying to like just. <laughs> 
I don't know. I, I can't do it. I mean, so that's like the closest we can get is doing that harmonic on the highest string, right? Nothing's working. Yeah, that's the closest we can get. So what do we do with this now? <laughs> Like, I love the whammy, but I really like how the Bigsby can spring back to your original pitch after you're done, because the whammy doesn't quite do that in the same way. So I I don't know. Let's try it with the Bigsby and see, see what we can do. <laughs> with a regular whammy bar on guitar, you can go up and down with the pitch, but with a whammy pedal, you can only go up or down with the pitch, so it's a little, a little harder to use. Yeah. In that way. <laughs> How would you use it? So the way I like to use the whammy pedal on harp is I like to add a delay pedal after it in the chain and really lean into those pitch bends. So when I, you know, kind of like sweep up with the pitch bend, it gets caught in the delay and it really emphasizes it. I like that. You can also use it as a chorus. Um, it does sound a little too digital for my taste, but take what you can get. So some of the harmony modes on this don't work quite as well on a polyphonic instrument like the harp, um, but I'm sure it would sound great on a lead, lead instrument part, like guitar. Um, but let me show you what doesn't really work so well. My biggest gripe with the whammy is the power source. Like I have to, I can't use it with my other pedal source. This is so selfish that it needs its own power supply. Like who has time for that? Like who is the room? I mean, it's, it's 2022, you could 
It's Tony, Tony, Tony too. Yeah, exactly. They should design this to be used with regular pedal power. Yeah. What, I'm gonna have a separate outlet for this thing? Look, it's already, look at this, it's huge. <laughs> Why do that to us? Well, Digitech's gone now, right? <laughs> they were bought, they were recently acquired by somebody. Attention, so. new Digitech. Make this usable with pedal power, please. The people want it. <laughs> I want it. <laughs> so I wanna thank everyone who donated during my live stream and made the purchase of this Digitech Whammy possible. Um, I really, really appreciate it. And I'm really happy I got to try it out. Uh, I'm gonna experiment more with it and figure out some more interesting ways to use it with harp. Also, thank you so much to guitar experts, Scott and Steven, uh, for helping me understand what a proper dive bomb is. <laughs> I'm not cool enough to do one yet, but I'm getting there, right? I got close. We're getting there. Experimentation, yeah, yeah that's yeah. what it's all about. Yeah. <laughs>